48. Been up to the fishmonger. We've got our whole salmon. I'm about to show you how to rip those fillets off. Yep. And get ready for this great dish we're about to create. So first things first, let's get out of the paper. Thin, underneath. Straight. Take your time, Jay, mate. Come on. There we go. Straight to the spine of the fish. You're going to feel it. That's where we've stopped. We're going to turn the knife. Just heard the click. That's running along those vertebrae. We're just going to run it down. Click, 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 click. All the way to the bottom. First fillet. Just going to run the knife up onto those bones. Obviously not going to slip through because it's bones. Bang. Look at that. That's just peeling away. Finish that off. Nice. This is the essential part. We need lots of salt on there because what we want is a really nice crusty skin. Do that. Really nice crusty skin. I might even give that a little bit of a rub in. And right now at home you're sitting there going, look how much salt he's putting on, but he's just going over and over again how we're going to get that crust. It's going to be salty. It's like the crackling. There's crackling. our poor crackling That's for our, our fish. That's our poor crackling. I like that. Are you waiting for this sizzle? Because I'm ready to give it to you. Listen to that. That's a sensational sound. That's what we're looking for. And have a look right there. You, you see this slurry? You, you, you're about to form a nice little salt and pepper slurry. You know what I mean? And like, that's just. Well, it's an oily fish. It's really, really good. Now, how long are we going to cook this for? Because we want to serve this salmon Mate, no to a medium rare. Minutes. No longer than 10 minutes. Okay, 10 minutes. All right, what I've got to do now, I'm going to mix all my ingredients into here the peppers, the lovely anoiki mushrooms. Just break these up, pick them up at any little sort of supermarket. Asian grocers have got them. Fresh ginger, straight in the bowl. Okay, some carrot, sorry, carrot, corn. What's going on there? The mushrooms, the oyster ones, there's our little cuppies, there's our little cuppies. Little cups. For our juice and the shiitakes. Okay, now back to seasoning again. A good drawing of cracked black pepper. Stack of cups. Thank you. And salt. a nice bit of sea salt there as well. Get the rest of that in. Now, toss that there. Give it a good oil up. Looking sensational, Duke. I can't wait to eat this one. It's going to be good. It's going to be really simple and really quick, okay? Straight on. Okay. Just spread that out on the barbecue plate. And now what we're doing is we're actually using the barbecue plate more like a wok. You yeah. know what I mean? You're so used Except to Except it's cook. flat. Exactly right. You're, just, you're so used to cooking, you know, ordinary stuff. Step out of your comfort zone and have a go. Now I can just put a bit of olive oil on because my food's already on there. Yeah, get your hands involved there. I reckon we could even drop that lid for a little bit. Mate, you read my mind, my man, you read my mind. I'm going to close this lid down for about four to five. Yep, four to get, five. Get, get a good steam sensation. Bang. Right, that's been a good four to five minutes. We dropped the lid. Lukey's lifted it up. Now, now just have a gander. Just have a little sneak, right? Look at that, that crispy yes. skin, right? We're going to hear, see that? That salt crust is starting to form a really, really nice hard crust. Now, what I'm going to do, a bit of soy sauce. We know it's in everyone's kitchen at home. It's going to drizzle soy sauce over our veg. Okay. Just going to finish it with whack a, a little bit of lime juice on there. Oh, that soy and lime's coming through with those mushrooms. But what now. I love about this, it's not complicated. They're not complicated sauces. They're in the bottles. They're in the fruit. Just get it on the plate. Exactly right. Now, what we're Josh, talking about. Yes. Hold that up for me. Okay. I'm just going to. Just going to portion this up. See, this is a great one for guests. You know, you've got four or five people coming around. You know, you whack this one on the barbecue, you set this at the table, and it's just, you're, you'll definitely be invited back to the next one. You can't bugger it up. You can eat all this stuff raw. Unless you play up too Overcooked, much on the ground. Undercooked. And it smells sensational. Here we go. Get all those little oils too, you know. We go back to every day. Don't leave anything off there. That's the mother love on there, you know. Ready, go. Now, pop back over here to the fish. All we're going to do now is just give that a flip. One flip. One flip. Okay, and I'm just going to get a bit of lemon juice and I'm just going to rub it across the skin like that. Just give and that what a we good want, rub there. All that lemon. Get the timer starting because that's only going to be a minute, two minutes max. And then you lick that lemon. We're not going to oh. overcook this $60 whole fish. We are not going to overcook. Let me repeat, we are not going to overcook. I'm not. He's a big chance. <laughs> Rightio. 
platter. I reckon we can get this off. Nah, I reckon. What do you reckon? One minute? Yep. Lid? Yep. Lid? Yep. Call it? Lid! Luki, pop down and have a look at this little baby. We've rested her up for a good minute or two. Yep. Okay, we want to serve this around a rare to medium rare. I mean, yep. you don't want to destroy this great fish. They eat it sashimi style for crying out loud. It was in the fish shop. That's right. 45 minutes ago, fresh off today, okay? On so our chopping board, really, looking really gorgeous. Fresh. Now look, as Josh was talking about, have a look. Have a look at these little ones, how they start to peel away. See that peeling away? It's just starting to... That's just a great sign that it's fresh, it's ready to go. And Joshy, let's get cutting, mate. Let's nail it. Rightio, flip her over. What do you reckon? We knock this into about. Yep. It's just falling apart beautifully. Look, even the dog's getting hungry. <laughs> now look at that. See how he's slicing that there and it's falling apart. Now, if my old man was here, he'd be over my back of my shoulder, going for this crackling right now. I'd so be crisp. on the ground. Slide that baby up. Go four. Four. Look at that. And look at that. Have a good look at that. Just before you put that down, Joshy, now look at that. That's what that's, that's exactly what we're looking for. Salmon. And if you're in a restaurant and they overcook it any more than that, send it back to the chef. Alright, dude. What do you reckon? A bit now, more juicy. You know what? I think it's done. It's done? We're done. Two chefs done. That's how we cook salmon. There's our baked salmon on the barbecue with our soy glazed vegetables. Get involved, turn the barbecue on. We're two chefs, J Mac, Luke. Thanks again to everyone for watching and for the continued support with the emails. We're getting through them and everyone who's requested a recipe will hear back from us as soon as we can. Remember to head over to www.twochefstv.com.au for all the latest news and information. And we'll see you again next time.